Okay, so this video is a demo tutorial for the 4D Ajax for Dreamweaver extension. Um, we're assuming that the installation was a success, so that means we could get along and get started um, playing around in Dreamweaver. So to get started, let's create a new HTML document. And let me move this over. Now, it's we just opened an HTML template, so really there's no content in there right now. Um, at the top, you'll notice seven buttons from the 4D Ajax extension. Now, to embed a 4D Ajax object, it, it really only takes three steps to get that object into an HTML page. Um, the first step involves importing the structure. So let's do that. To do that, we have to go to the we have to select the support folder next to our um, our 4D structure. Extras, support, and there it is. Let's hit the select button. And our structure is imported. The second step is to enter login information. So now here we have to enter login information as users connect to the HTML page. Um, for demonstration pur purposes, let's have them log in as administrator. And we'll click OK. Now, some code has been added to the page. Um, the only code that concerns us really is the function for DAX load and the code added in the body element for the on load event. OK. Now, the third and final step is to just choose which object to embed. Um, we can choose from a data, a data grid, a calendar, a data tree, a data matrix, and an image matrix. Uh, for today, we're just going to embed a data grid. So let's hit that button. And this dialog comes up. Here we can choose which table or DDW or D, DCS or view to embed. Today I'm going to choose the, the customer table. We can also we can also select advanced settings, but I won't touch any of that today. If anything, I'll just change the the width and the height. So now some code's been added in the body element, a div class to display the data grid, and up top. Under the JavaScript, you'll see where we created the data grid object. It's nicely commented too to show where the code started and where it ended. And that's all we have to do. Three steps to embed an object. So if we save this HTML file in our web root, I'll call it grid, we should be able to see our object. So let's go to our browser and connect to the HTML page we just created. And there we go, our live data grid in our HTML page. All the functionality of a, a normal data grid in the 40 Ajax um, client environment, you can edit a record. And you can create one, and you can do live searching. So that's our demo tutorial for the 4D Ajax for Dreamweaver extension. We just displayed how to easily embed a live 4D Ajax object into a HTML page.